Hello everyone, welcome back to Cook We Will. Today I'm going to show you how to cook langos, which is a popular street food in Europe. The first thing we need to do is bring the yeast back to life. I'm, used, I'm using fresh one, so it's gonna go fast. We need a little bit of sugar and some milk. Now mix it. Now let it sit for a few minutes until foam starts to form. Okay, the yeast looks good, it's alive and kicking. Now let's mix all the ingredients together. Flour. Milk. Salt. And sour cream. You can totally mix the dough by hand, but since I have a stand mixer, I'm gonna make my life easier. The dough looks good, this is the right consistency, so let's form a ball, cover it with some foil or a towel and let it rise for about one and a half hour. Okay, let's check the dough. It looks good, it more than doubled in size, so we can move to the next step. Put some oil on your hands and grab about a handful of the dough, like this. And now use your hands to make a round shape. The shape doesn't have to be perfect, just try to keep it round. You can also put the dough on the table and continue with the shaping. The edge should be a little bit thicker than the center. You can also use a roller. Okay, this is what it should look like. And now it's time to fry it. Drop a little piece of the dough into the oil. As you can see, it's frying already, so we're ready to go. It takes about one or two minutes per side. This one is ready to flip. Okay, the first one is ready. Let's place it on a paper towel. Langosh is served with a variety of toppings. My favorite ones are garlic oil. This is just oil mixed with garlic and a little bit of salt. Then grated cheese. You can be generous with the cheese. A little bit of tartar sauce. And some ketchup. Some people also use sour cream or just simple, just with the garlic oil. It's entirely up to you. And this is it. Now let me taste what I made. 